Hey guys, Ben here, and welcome back to another video on The Flash Season 5, and today we're going to be talking about the first leaked set photos that have been released with our main actors. So if you do go on to enjoy the video, please be sure to leave a like and a comment, and subscribe if you're new, so you don't miss any DC TV videos later this year. So, sorry that I couldn't get this video out last night, but it was super late when these photos started appearing online via multiple sources, and we've got so much to break down. The main thing is that there is some suit reveals and also there's a big change and there's some theories that I need to talk about with you guys but before we actually get into this I have to give full credit to Themyscira Bounds, Canada Graphs and YVR Shoots because those are the main sources from where these photos actually came they were all camping around the set and they were able to get some fabulous photos of some of the cast members around the set mainly Jessica Parker Kennedy and Grant Gustin there is a lot of Grant Gustin ones but if you guys want to check them out out, please be sure to go to their Twitter links which will be in the description below and also Canada Graphs has more photos over on his blog so go check that out that will be in the description below so all rights go to them for these photos but anyway without further ado let's get right into this video so I'm going to be breaking these photos down there isn't necessarily going to be a specific order but first off I'm going to be going over Nora Allen so we've got our first photos of Nora that being Jessica Parker Kennedy as she was shooting on set but she was actually being hidden and the crew members were trying to hide her so we didn't get any big reveals because they obviously know that there is cameramen you know the paparazzi around trying to get photos of the new season and guess what we got some which is good for us but bad for them but essentially Themyscira Bound got a great photo from a pretty high angle and it showcases a lot of her suit which we'll talk about in a sec but also Canada Grass was the first person to actually come through with these photos revealing that on her suit it is the Iris West suit that we saw earlier in the season, but it's modified. It has the excess sign on her chest, so that is ripped out of the comics, literally. It's just a bit bigger in the comics. This is just a small emblem. I don't know how I feel about it, but I'll get more into my feelings in a minute. And also, specifically in Canada Graphs photos, they actually were able to get a photo of her boots. And, oh my god, they look amazing. Look at that, gold and black. I think the colour contrast is absolutely brilliant. And I just kind of wish they went for a better suit than what they have. I don't really like the colour scheme with the black and white. And I think they should have maybe gone for the gold and black. I think that would have suited it a lot better. And that's why I think the boots work really well. But in Themyscira Bound's photo of Jessica Parker Kennedy fully suited up, we get to see a bigger body shot of her. And you can see that in fact she does have the gauntlets on her arm that we saw at the end of the season so it is in fact her that saved Barry at the end of season 4 so if you go back and look at that that is probably our best look because that was heavily focused upon and as we've seen from previous set photos what we actually get to see in the final product sometimes is very changed this is what it looks like on set from a regular camera and so it is Iris's mask it's Iris's suit and it's just modified for her so she has the gauntlets, she has the new boots and she has the excess symbol on her costume so maybe she is calling herself excess or maybe that's just to pay homage to the comics and she has a similar mask to Iris's mask in season 4 so overall my thoughts on the suit it's a very good suit I really like the gauntlets I really like the boots and I like the mask but I don't really like the main color scheme of the suit I don't really like the logo, how it's just plonked on. It seems very out of place and doesn't really feel like it actually fits in there. So my feelings are mixed. Let me know in the comments below what do you think of Nora Allen's suit. So moving on to probably the next big stuff, or maybe it's even bigger. And this is the fact that Grant Gustin was seen on set shooting in his Flash Season 1 suit, which is crazy. So there are so many theories that we need to go over, but essentially he was fighting a villain that you can see on the screen right now. He looks kind of weird, this villain. Nice mask, but it's a bit weird how his beard's sticking out. I don't know how I feel about that, but he's just the villain of the week, nothing too special. And so Grant was shooting as Barry, supposedly in the past, because he is wearing that suit. Because 
even though, yes, the suit got destroyed at the end of Season 4, I don't think he's going to go back to his original suit. So, let's get into some theories. So, number one theory is obviously time travel. So, I do believe with Nora making that mistake, with it being a time travel heavy season as it's been teased, I do in fact think that this version of Barry that we're seeing is back in time, but I do think it's from Nora's perspective because we know that Nora was around when they were actually shooting that scene and Nora did have a line of dialogue according to Canada Graphs and apparently Nora said Barry what are you doing so that is the only piece of dialogue that was heard around the set but it does in fact confirm that she's back in time with her or something like that and I don't think it's Barry time traveling I think it's Nora time traveling back in time to around the season one area where we get to see Barry supposedly back in time fighting this villain and maybe this is part of the reason as to why Nora's stuck in our time maybe she tried to go too back maybe she tried to go too far back or something like that and she messed up but I do think that the time travel theory is the best theory and that's what I think is going to happen but another theory is that Barry is just using this suit like I mentioned earlier, which I don't think he would do that. I don't see any logical reason, even though I do actually prefer this suit than the season 4 suit in my opinion. And so the most logical explanation is that this is just a flashback and they're shooting a scene from when around the season 1 time when Barry would be fighting one of his first metahumans around that time, you know, within the first year or so in becoming the Flash. And so I do think that's true but I don't think it's a flashback I do think it's the time travel explanation because of the fact that Nora was actually seen shooting at the same time of this so let me know in the comments below do you think they're doing time travel I definitely think they are and also what do you think of Nora's suit let's see how it looks on screen before we pass proper judgment so anyway guys thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you guys later goodbye Strong, it doesn't make us weak. Tongue tied to service like shark breed.